Hey everybody, Paul here. Okay, I want to show you what I have found to be the easiest way to peel, cut, and seed butternut squash. Um, these are the items that I'll be using, and that would be a small knife, um, a chef knife, and a spoon. You can use a smaller spoon. I got a, it's a little bigger spoon here, and a potato peeler. Okay, so all you need to do is take your small knife, and this is all you're going to need your small knife for. Sharp, sharp side facing up. Just come into the bottom and just spin it. Okay, and just take that little bottom core off. Okay, that's all you're going to need that little knife for. All right, next thing you're going to do is take your chef knife and just cut this end right off like so, okay? Next thing you're going to do is you're going to, with your potato peeler, just start peeling the bottom here and work your way out until you get to that maximum point where it bulges out, okay? And the best thing to do is to, uh, you know, just keep cutting it till you get these green lines off, and then swing it around, and then take some of it off on the edge here, okay? Then once you get to that point, then just start Peeling it down this way, okay? And just go all the way around and get it peeled to where it looks like this. And again, I found the best way is to just get all these green lines off, okay? So then what you'll do next is you're going to just take your chef knife, and I like it because it's heavy so it goes through it real easy. Just wiggle it back and forth. Just cut that thing in half. Okay, then take your spoon and just scoop out, and they'll come out real easy. And this is why I like a bigger spoon. You usually just get it all out in one twist. Just scoop that out. There's a little more in there. So just clean that out until those seeds come completely out. Okay. There's the seed, there's the, uns there's the seeded, okay? Then, just take, and I'll stand it up like so, and then and then I'll just start cutting it in lengths like this, okay? Then, you know, you can cut a little more that way if you want. But then basically, I just start chopping it up, okay? So then I'll take these chunks and I'll put it in a Ziploc bag and uh, put it in the freezer. Then it's all ready to go and it's really easy to make. All you gotta do is boil it, mash it, uh, add a little brown sugar, butter to it, and it's absolutely fabulous. If you wanna make it extra smooth and creamy, um, my wife puts it in a uh, high-speed blender, and that really makes it nice, and it actually you know, makes a lot makes a lot less work too. So that's all there is to it. Easy peasy, <laughs> and it's just a wonderful um, dish to make. And everybody, there's six of my family, and everybody just loves this stuff, and it's good for you. So hey, if you like this video, would you hit the like button below? And share it with your friends and please be sure to subscribe. God bless you and have a great day. Bye for now.